spotted saddle horse and she's had some time off about um, six months something like that and they weren't sure if she ever gated before or not so she's got a nice slow walk now she can do a little bit of a flat walk when i pushed her further to see if she had anything she can't do a running walk she can't do a fox trot she can hard trot and she can't do a rack or a saddle gate or any of those things. So I kind of played around. You'll see me popping her head up. I'll show you all that to see if I could get a little bit of it, but we didn't get much at all. And I did get a little bit of it on the lunge line, but very slow. So when you have a horse like this, what we have to do is condition her more and then see if we can get more of her gait because she's not naturally doing it. She naturally trots and she snaps her knees up and down. So she's very dry. to start using her muscles better before I pick up any speed because otherwise as soon as I pick up speed it goes more towards that trot and it's very uncomfortable so the other thing she's got this snaffle well Okay, in case you couldn't hear me, it's Gay Derusa with a Majestic Rider, and this is a horse that just came in for training, and she hasn't been ridden for a long time, and I'm trying to see if she can gait at all. So what you're seeing here is I'm speeding her up a little bit just to see what she can do, and I'm trying to pop her head up because she's very trotty, but you'll see she just keeps falling into a trot. So this is kind of the test ride. You know, I made sure she was safe and everything. And then I'm trying to see uh, what kind of talent she has. Does she know how to gate? Does she have any clue? Was she gated before? So you'll see me pulling my hands up and trying to get her head up because she's so trotty. So I'm trying to make her a little bit more lateral. So what I did was I kept trying to pop her head up. I tried to turn her head sideways a little bit because sometimes that'll help the horses get lateral. And that's what she did on the lunge line. And then she did gait a little bit. So here I'm more flat walking. So she does have a flat walk. Because I gave up, I figured, well, she doesn't know what she's doing. So let's just try to get her flat walk down and then we'll try it again. So she, there she fell into the trot again. So every time she does, I just half halt and bring her back to her flat walk. So she has a decent flat walk. It's not fast, but she is head shaking and she is stepping up behind. So there she's doing a decent flat walk. See how high she picks her knees up? That's because she's on the trotty side. So she has shoes on the front, nothing on the back, no special angles, no heavy shoes or anything like that. And when they have shoes in the front and none in the back and they're trotty, that makes them trottier. And then when you ride them in the arena, that also makes them trotty because the footing's different or, and it's deep. So that's everything going against me trying to get her to gate. So there she was flat walking pretty well. But you'll see anytime I ask her to speed up a little bit to see if I can get her to flat walk faster. She just falls into that hard trot. She doesn't even fox trot. There she's just getting a little antsy as I'm trying to speed her up. So I'm just playing around seeing what things work there. She's trotting. And you see pretty much nothing's working except her flat walk. So what I'm trying to do is devise a plan. What do I have to do with this horse? I kept trying. Will she gate? No. So let's just go back to flat walking. So with this horse, I'm more planning to get a flat walk. And then once I get her conditioned better to go towards a running walk. 
the spotted saddle horses some can do a flat walk and a running walk and a saddle gait and some just do a flat walk and a saddle gait so with her though I'm gonna go towards a running walk so there's a flat walk and that's pretty good and that's why it gave me hopes like all I got to do is get her to do this well and hold it consistently and then over time I can speed her up and I should have a running walk because otherwise when I speed her up she shortens her step she goes into that trot but she's trying she just has no clue what I'm trying to get from her here she's doing pretty well still at a flat walk there she's more relaxed with her head down but you'll see there she picked up a little bit more speed and we started going out of the flat walk again so some of it's me testing and some of it she just speeds up and then she goes towards that trot see there's a trot again so she doesn't pace at all she's on the trotty side or what you call the square side and so I'm just going to work over the next month on this flat walk, getting her conditioned, and then try to speed her up. I'm going to change the bit also and play around with that just to see if I can make her more comfortable in her mouth. I think this bit has too many moving parts. It has a dog bone in the middle. There she goes back towards the trot. So we'll see. I might try a miler bit or a wonder bit. All right, there she's more relaxed. There she goes towards the trot again. And her trot is not comfortable. It's not towards a fox trot. It is quite bouncy. But overall, for not being ridden in a while, she was very well behaved. So we just got to work on that gate. 